we very infrequently use eminent domain as a means to uh, negotiate with uh, landowners, and we will not use that as a hammer over the landowner's head. We will do everything in our power to be able to work with you to be able to uh, come to an agreement before we use eminent domain. But if I still say no, you will use eminent domain. We have the right to, to do take that, my yes. property and my neighbor's property. We will fairly there. compensate you for your property. But, but and, uh, sometimes the uh, value of my land and my water is okay. worth more than any dollar amount uh, I, I can that appreciate you can that. take. Yeah. So if we support, as commissioners, if they support the pipeline, they are inevitably supporting the right of Dominion to take <coughs> citizens in this county's land by eminent domain. Even though you're not going to use that as the first resort, you're going to try to negotiate, but there are many of us who are pretty adamant that we're not going to give us your land, so then we can look forward to having it taken from us. Correct? Well, you asked me a question about what the position of the commissioners are. I can, I can answer okay. the commissioners. But you're, no, I'm, I'm taking that aside, but if, if I... Uh, what's your question? I, I my question really is, question is that, is. that you, your company uses eminent domain, and then if my neighbors and I absolutely refuse to negotiate with you on a price that you will take us to court and use eminent domain. What domain. I said was that we we have the right to use eminent domain, okay. and, and very infrequently we use eminent domain. But you have used it. Yes, we have. Okay. And my experience in Colorado with that is they do it, and they do it all the time. And and it's gotten to the point in Colorado where on our own land, we have to sign waivers to be on our own land to inspect these things. Well, I think we're about 